Make a slip knot and chain four. If you're unsure of what I'm doing, e.g. if you don't know how to chain or do trebles, please go watch my other tutorial videos. Thank you for watching my videos. I really hope you enjoy them. Slip stitch in the first chain you did. Chain 3. This counts as your first treble. Because your chain 3 counts as a treble, you need to do 11 trebles in the hole. slip stitch in the third chain stitch like before chain three this will count as a treble do two trebles in each stitch slip stitch in the third chain stitch
you will have 24 stitches. Chain 3, again this counts as a treble. The stitch may be hard to see at first, but when you have made these a few times, it should get easier to see. You need to increase like you would when you are working in the round, but this time your increase comes first, the chain 3 and 1 treble. Do 1 treble in this stitch. Do one treble in the next stitch. You need to increase again. Do two trebles in the next stitch. You need to repeat this sequence all the way around. One treble in the next stitch and two trebles in the next stitch. You will have 12 more stitches on each row. Chain three. Do your one treble in the next stitch. This time you need to do one treble in two stitches and two trebles in the next stitch. You need to repeat this sequence all the way around and slip stitch in the top third chain stitch. You do an extra treble on each row. For example, on the next row you would do your increase, then three trebles and an increase. On the next row you would do four trebles instead of three. 